this next section from Psalm 119. We'll not read all of Psalm 119 today. Uh, those of you who know your Bibles will know it's the longest psalm in the Bible. But it's all about God's Word. And the second section Richard is going to read for us now. And he doesn't know this yet, but I want him to read it once, then pause, and then read it a second time. Okay, Richard. Okay, this is Psalm 119, beginning at verse 9. How can a young person stay on the path of purity by living according to your word? I seek you with all my heart. Do not let me stray from your commands. I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Pr praise be to you, Lord. Teach me your decrees. With my lips I recount all the laws that come from your mouth. I rejoice in following your statutes as one rejoices in great riches. I meditate on your precepts and consider your ways. I delight in your decrees. I will not neglect your word. Okay, before Richard reads the second time, I'd like you to do something for me. Close your eyes. Just listen to Richard reading these words. And as he does that, my prayer is that the Holy Spirit will highlight a phrase in this passage of Scripture that God wants to speak directly to you about today. Okay? So if you'll do that for me, close your eyes and Richard will read again. How can a young person stay on the path of purity? By living according to your word. I seek you with all my heart. Do not let me stray from your commands. I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Praise be to you, Lord. Teach me your decrees. With my lips I recount all the laws that come from your mouth. I rejoice in following your statutes as one rejoices in great riches. I meditate on your precepts and consider your ways. I delight in your decrees. I will not neglect your word. Thank you, Richard. What do you want? What do you want? 